Currently, humanity is aware of one planet in the universe that is capable of supporting life. It's it's Earth. That that's it. But our galaxy is home to about a billion stars. Chances are that there are other Earth-like planets out there. Where are they? Most of the exoplanets we found, that's planets around other stars, they're not like Earth. They tend to be more massive and orbit much closer to their star. Either Earth is indeed weird, and most planets are these more massive, hotter variety, or we're just not finding the Earth-like planets. Good news! We're probably just not finding. Not so great news, it's because all of our methods are rather biased. Our best method is the transit method. This involves watching the light from stars, watching for a dip as a planet crosses in front of them, or transits. This simple method is biased in two ways. A bigger planet is going to block more light. The second bias comes from the intricacies of confirming an exoplanet transit. One isn't enough. We need multiple detections of the transit to confirm that it is indeed an exoplanet. We're also going to be biased towards planets that orbit their stars more frequently. What all of this means is that these so-called hot Jupiters, these massive planets orbiting close to their stars, these are essentially the low-hanging fruit of the exoplanet population. They're the easiest to find, so it makes sense we found them first. Detecting Earth-like exoplanets is going to be a little bit harder, but I won't be surprised if we find one within my lifetime.